Down in southern Iowa, Metro just some light showers now. 74 dew point 69, west winds at 6, that humidity 85%. Storm came along with the storms. We had some pretty pictures in behind. This from northern Lucas County and a nice shot near Indianola of some colors there in the sky, but still some rain. Lighter rain up and through Warren County right now. It really picks up as you head from Melcher down and through Lamoni and even northern Missouri. Princeton, Missouri is seeing rain right now. Again, that rain van word, Leon, down in through Lineville and all moving to the east. KCCI News app, hour by hour weather checking out at 4 a.m. 68. 10 a.m. tomorrow, 72. Notice rain chances near zero. A little bit of a north breeze bringing in lower humidities. 4 p.m. temperature 80 by 10 p.m. tomorrow down to 71 degrees. It's going to be cooler in behind this cold front. Watch these storms. They really intensified in Marion and then Mahaska County. Beacon, which is near Oskaloosa, 60 mile per hour gusts. And I was watching this storm near Barnes City that produced some wind damage to trees there. It looked like gusts in Barnes City could have been in excess of 70 miles an hour just for a brief period. There's the line that caused the wind damage now moving to the east. It has weakened a little bit. And then this is the rain down south. And that should be about it as the front is transitioning through the state. Heavier rain right now down in Missouri and parts of Kansas. And that may try to sneak into southeastern Iowa. All this firing along a front, which is moving down to the south. High pressure building in. And that is going to bring us a temporary a uh, period of some tranquil weather before the front returns. So here's Futurecast doing a good job. Those storms moving out. This activity mainly just southeastern Iowa sweeping on through. I think most states should be dry by Thursday early morning and mostly cloudy for the afternoon. Now going into Friday, it looks like southern Iowa could have some morning rain and then some evening thunderstorms. The rest of us, I think, will hold off until late Friday night into Saturday morning. The system winds up. Some computer models are starting to bring the rain out a little earlier on Saturday, but we could see some redevelopment later in the day. This would be additional rainfall tonight. And you can see that strip of heavier rain east and southeast of Lamoni with lighter amounts as you head towards I-80, although still accumulating fairly heavy over in east central Iowa. Town to town, 79 in Adel tomorrow, 80 in Indianola. Look for mostly cloudy skies. Upper 70s, Crest and Autumn in your high tomorrow at 80 degrees. Partly cloudy, Jefferson 78, Estherville a cool 75. Partly cloudy skies in upper 70s, Hampton down to Marshalltown, and then clouds early, and then some late day sun in Centerville, 80, Atoma, 80 degrees. Forecast 65, storms mainly down to the south, non severe. Northwest winds 5 to 10, 82 tomorrow, mostly cloudy with a northwest breeze. Dry for most of us on Friday, except for southern Iowa. Our chances are Friday night into Saturday. Then it should be dry Sunday, Monday, and then it looks like it could get stormy midweek next week. Highs generally in the 80s next week.